Usually when we examine patients, we take x-rays and then we have a full examination. And that's very important to do that. So because by doing that, we try to examine the teeth that might have cracks or sometimes might have a large decays below a certain fillings, what we call like secondary decays. So we can give the patients a forecast of a possibility that might, that disease is not treated. It might lead to what we call it a root canal or a diseased pulp. And then eventually, because the bacteria is going to invade the pulp chamber and causes inflammation, and that, of course, would lead into pain and uh, then needing root canal. So one of the things that we look into or the teeth that might eventually need uh, a root canal therapy is or treatment is like teeth with deep decays, broken fillings, or even sometimes repeated dental work that we might think, oh, we look to it and on the x-rays we see that that tooth has what we call like a chronic infection and the patient simply doesn't have a lot of symptoms but it's just like when he chews on a hard subject it gives him that feeling that ah it's a bit of discomfort and that might you know but when we look into the x-rays we can find that that tooth had an inflammation and the inflammation is a bit chronic so this is like a ticking bomb it needs to be treated because otherwise if it's left what would happen it might spread and get bigger and some other teeth get involved or it might, some of that infection might go from chronic to acute and give him a lot of pain. So it needs to be treated. This is why it's very important. Regular dental checkups with x-rays to see the overall oral hygiene of that patient and to give them a forecast of what's needed and, and how we can keep those teeth as long as possible.